What is going on, Rebel Nation? Hope y'all doing good here today. And I got something that has been on my mind uh, really all day for the past 24 hours or so. And that is involving the Ole Miss starting quarterback, Matt Corral. Now, Matt Corral was injured in the first quarter last night in the Sugar Bowl. And that was his last game as the Ole Miss Rebel. And, man, every Ole Miss fan was heartbroken last night. You know, Matt Corral, hands down our best player. He's our leader, uh, our hype man. You know, always giving teammates motivation and advice. And he's just a guy everybody looks up to. He's a guy everybody wants to be like as well. And just to see your best player go down. Uh, and, of course, you know, just knowing this was his last game as a Rebel. That's just the way we hate to see his crew in. You know, of course, if it's Corral or somebody else, you know, you want your players to have one more win, one more good memory. Just have one more good time with your teammates here in college. And just to see his career end like that off an of injury, man, we we're every Ole Miss fan is heartbroken, you know, very sad and mad and disappointed uh just didn't feel like it was fair for Ole Miss last night and many Ole Miss fans still heartbroken of what happened last night I'm still pretty heartbroken and upset about it myself but just hate to see Matt Corral's injury happen like that in his last game I just I hate it for Matt I hate it for all the Ole Miss fans as well just really hate it but I started thinking about Matt Corral's time here at Ole Miss, and the kids went through a bunch. And now when he first came to Ole Miss, he was a backup quarterback. He was on the bench there for the first couple years. And I still remember that there are many Ole Miss fans saying Matt Corral is not the answer. Matt Corral should transfer. And I got into some pretty big arguments with some Ole Miss fans. I definitely did not see eyeball to eyeball on some things. But Matt Corral was always a kid I believed in. I thought he had a whole bunch of potential. And definitely happy Matt Corral decided to stay for sure. And every Ole Miss fan, very, very happy you decided to stay. And also, thank you for playing last night. I know there's many players from other teams who decided to opt out. I'm not a huge fan of opt outs. The way I look at it is if you opt out, you're quitting on your team. That's just kind of my quick thoughts on it. But coming from an Ole Miss fan, I thank you. Thank you, Matt, for playing for Ole Miss. Playing one more time. I mean, there's many fans who travel to New Orleans. You know, many fans driving five, six hours, eight hours, ten hours to come watch you play one more time. You know, many fans paying hundreds and hundreds of dollars to come watch you play one more time. And coming from an Ole Miss fan myself, and I'm pretty sure every Ole Miss fan can say this for themselves as well. But Matt, if you're ever watching this video, just thank you. Thank you, Matt, for everything you've done here at Ole Miss. You know, even when you first came to Ole Miss, we're going through some pretty hard times back when we had Matt Luke. And um, the future may not be looking the best at the time, but you decided to stick around here at Ole Miss. You believed in Ole Miss. You believed things will get better. And just thank you for staying here at Ole Miss your whole entire career. Thank you for playing last night. I'm a huge fan of you for sure, and this really support you for playing last night as well. Of course, hate to see you injured, hate what happened, but um, just just your overall career, just everything you've done here at Ole Miss. Thank you, Matt. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You know whatever happens now, uh, talking about your NFL future, wherever you go. Ole Miss fans want to support you no matter what, brother. You know, if you play in California, if you play in Florida, play in New York, wherever you play at, Ole Miss fans will support you no matter what, brother. So, thanks again for everything you've done here at Ole Miss. Hotty toddy. Best of luck, brother.